Make sure you insert the CD-ROM into your CD-ROM drive before playing, boys and girls. Your computer appears to not have a CD-ROM drive. How, how can this be? <laughs> Welcome, boys and girls. It's good to see you again. It's been so long, but the story's still here waiting for you, and it's still as true as ever. Let's read it together now. Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of tonight's Halloween Spook Fest, and also a play by the Pound episode while we're at it. This is Cheetahs Are Meant To Be Fast. This was made for the recent uh, 2021 Game Jam on uh, weightgaining.com or whatever the fuck the website's actual URL is. I don't remember. It's a, it's a forum where Game Jams occasionally, occasionally happen for weight game focused games, and this one was made. Uh, it is a wholesome... Completely innocent uh, game that has absolutely no reason to be on Halloween Spook Fest, I'm sure. But, you know, uh, this is an interactive storybook about how being a fat guy who eats a lot is very morally wrong and not at all awesome or attractive and that you should be fed. So, re really, pr you know, perfectly appropriate content for our show. Uh, <laughs> this is styled as, in, as, as if it is an old... CD-ROM. I'm kind of actually curious here. Anybody grow up or is old enough or remembers the old storybook-based CD-ROM games where it was really just you're going through an interactive storybook page by page. You can click on things, get a lot of interactions. That is basically what this is. Uh, if you are, if you do, if you are too young for this, well, welcome to a blast for the past because this is styled very accurately to that. Uh, it's kind of, I, I kind of like how uh, Baldi's Basics. Is a is styled in old Egyptian CD-ROMs and such, kind of like that. Anyways, before we fully begin, though, if you like the video, do think about giving it a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, think about doing that as well. And if you really want to help out, come over to come over to Twitch. Whether you want to lurk or talk, I'm trying to reach partner, and your view count matters. So uh, please consider adding to that view count. Also, we have a pretty cool Discord community, and I have a coffee link if you want to help directly monetize my content. So, links are in the description. Check them out if you feel like checking them out. But anyways, let's go ahead and play Cheetahs Are Meant To Be Fast. Now, uh, the, the volume may be a little weird, but I'm gonna I've just turned on subtitles, so that should fix any sort of sound issues we might have. Uh, but let's see. Cheetahs Are Meant To Be Fast. Dirch Denwald Software's Read Along Tales by Eddie Bludgeon. Bludgeon? Okay. So we can mouse over. Let's see. Cheetahs Are Meant To Be Fast by Eddie Bludgeon. Okay. I'm assuming the subtitles will start once we start the story. Here's this proper story. What else we got? Ricky Rhino's waiting game. <laughs> Ricky Rhino's waiting game. Okay. That's a, we can play a game. Rachel Rat's Crafty Arty Center. Ra Rachel Rat's Crafty Arty Center? Oh, okay. Create some art. The Healthy Eating Parade. Oh, the Healthy Eating Parade. We can also watch that. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and read the story though. And if I need to turn up the volume, let me know. But uh <laughs> and we'll see. Ouch, Char pronouncing German words. Well, you... Does that word mean anything? <laughs> Out of curiosity? Let's begin with the story. Cheetahs are meant to be fast. Yes. Are you sitting comfortably? Well then, let's do something about that. Uh, what? A rhino is meant to be strong. A rat is meant to be sneaky. And deers are meant to have big twitchy ears, as penguins are meant to be beaky. What? <laughs> Chat looked into the mirror, thought, oh my, this cannot last. I've got a big belly that wobbles like jelly, and cheetahs are meant to be fast. Oh dear, oh dear, look at poor Chet. That's not how a cheetah should look, is it, boys and girls? Click his tummy to see it wobble. And when you're ready, click next to go to a new page. Okay. Oh, I can scroll around, too. All right, we got here. So we got... Unclickable Rhino for some reason. I'm not sure why he's unclickable, but okay. Derek the Deer. Hello. I I can't interact with him. <laughs> this rat looks looks very suspicious. <laughs> Piddle did the penguin. I don't think I could actually interact with him though. Wobble Chet's tubby. Sure. Wobble. Okay, little one, I think it's time we moved on. Lots more storybook to get through. Oh, you're just gonna push me forward? Alright. What if I wanna do it more? B 
Pinky has a word now, they said it. Burp. Wobble. Cheetahs are meant to be dangerously cheesy. Sure. I'll take it. We should move on. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> I lost control of my cursor. It's it's it wants to move. It wants to move. It wants to move on. It wants to move on. No, I want to wobble. I gotta fight it. I don't know if there's anything else to do here. It really wants to fight me. <laughs> It doesn't look like me any new interactions though, so I think I have to move on. All right, let's let's go ahead and move on then. I'll let it do it automatically. There you go, buddy. There, there you go, narrator. Go ahead and move the cursor yourself. The next option's in the corner, if you can't tell. Oh, it doesn't actually press it though. All right, press. The shed was too heavy for pole vault, too big to jump over a hurdle, and gosh, was he slow? His leg wouldn't go. Poor Chet couldn't outrun a turtle, and turtles are very slow, boys and um, and turtles are very slow, boys and girls. <laughs> yeah, they they are yes. Chet had developed a sweet tooth. He loved munching on cookies and cake. Oh, Chet! He'd guzzle all night till his waistband was tight. But watch how he squares his mistake. What is going on today? Um, let's go to the next page, boys and girls. Quickly! Hmm. Things are... Oh, wait, is that something... Chet was. Yes, Chet was. Why can't... Why can't I highlight Chet was? That's weird. Wobble? No. Turtle, hi. Oh! <laughs> I was trying to click the... I was trying to click the turtle and I clicked the menu. Sneaky, sneaky menu. Alright, let's see. <laughs> hmm. Squares. Can, can I do something with this? I don't think so. Squares, though. <laughs> Feed him cake. Yeah, I feel like there should be some interactions here, but I don't quite understand. Maybe I can combine the words together. Chet was squares. He just was. Um, something is wrong with interactive. I don't. I think there's. Doesn't seem like there's anything I can really interactive here. Hmm. All right. Onward and upward, I suppose. A diet was desperately needed. He gathered his pastries and bread. He threw all that garbage into the garbage and said, I'll eat salad instead. There's Chet's friend Rachel the Rat again. She's helping Chet get rid of his bad food with her crafty contraptions. <laughs> I made a trebuchet to get rid of your food. <laughs> happens when you click that catapult. Or catapult, I suppose. <laughs> see what happens when we click the Chet the Cheetah and Rachel the Rat. Okay. Let's see what happens. Look at that. Chet doesn't look very happy. He had lots of juice from a juice bar. He dined on boiled chicken and rice. If his medal were tested, he'd stare as suggested at a cheetah whose figure was nice. Where's the other pie go every time I do this? Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> every foot race. He finishes in record time. He never eats pie or anything fried. He feels like a cat in his prime. Aim a bit lower. Can you do that? Now he's finally thin. Chet got married. And a fancy job out in the city. His love life and health. His business face well. Look, he became a he became a total Chad. Do you see what can happen if you start changing your lifestyle, boys and girls? Why not click on Chet's wristwatch to make it sparkle? Look, you can get rich if you're thin. <laughs> oh, what? Hold on. 
Ricket the Rhino? Oh no, he's gonna develop Rickets later in life. Sad turtle! Oh, look at the sad turtle. He was just happy he had somebody he could beat in a race. Now he can't do that anymore. Also, race is like highlightable here. Interesting. Okay. Why is this? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just what it looks like. Why does this look like a blow-up doll? This does not look real. This does not look like it has sentience. Sparkly. So fucking loudly spark- Oh my god, stop- Stop sparkly, thank you. Combine them together! Are these sparkly or magical at this point? Oh my god. All right, move it on. So remember, dear boys and girls, take heed, you're not getting younger. Don't live with regret like poor chubby Chet and learn to ignore your hunger. Starve yourself. <laughs> For a boy is meant to be toned and a girl is meant to be slender. It's feasible to see what you're meant to be and put down that chicken tender. Hooray, wasn't that fun, boys and girls? What do you think the story was trying to tell us? Draw your own oh, lovely na no casual 90s no sexism. Draw your own conclusions, okay. Being husky is very bad for you. That's an interesting answer. Maybe we could learn more about healthy diet and exercise in this CD-ROM's other activities. Follow me to the menu, boys and girls. Don't dilly-dally now. Hmm. Chet sure looks not forcibly happy at all, right? <laughs> That's not a smile you make at gunpoint. No, what are you talking about? <laughs> Spoon part of this game is a story. Yeah. The, the whole game thin thing. That's the scary. See, that's why this, this is why we have this on Halloween Spook Fest. Because there's nothing more scary than weight loss. <laughs> now let's enjoy this fine range of activities. Ricky Rhinos. Ricky Rhinos. Rich, the, the healthy cheetahs are meant Rachel Rack. I love the mouse over. Rich Let's, rhinos, game. Let's do Ricky Rhinos waiting game, I guess. Game. Okay. Hold on a second, let me get my CD drive for a moment. I, you know, they still, this doesn't sound like a good CD-ROM drive. This sounds like a CD-ROM drive that probably should be removed before it catches fire. It actually opens a CD drive when that pops up. Aha! Joke's on you, I don't have one! <coughs> but also, that's kind of funny. Ah, All that waiting. Just two not detected, return to win menu. Yeah, I guess I can't detect the disc when I can't actually answer the disc. <laughs> Scared me the first time. Yes, games, uh, back in the day when CD-ROMs were actually, like, more of a thing, indeed, their applications could just casually open your CD-ROM drive and be like, hey, go ahead and put a new disc in or something. Like, or, yeah, they, they could do that. This game, the game does not actually, does actually know if you have a CD drive or not. Interesting. And Cobbits on it. Yeah, that was the loading, that was the intro, when, when we were in the intro, it actually commented on the fact that I didn't have one. Let's go, let's go make some art. Use a stamp to place cherry tomatoes on the salad. Okay. What are the other tools? <laughs> Please there's this two to play retro with Crafty Artie's in her. Aw. Welcome, boys, and... Wait, that's not meant to be there. Um, nothing to worry about, boys and girls. Just a little oopsie. I'm sure if we run the story again, that big silly menu will go away. Well, the paint, I, I could, can I put cherry tomatoes on the menu? Hell yeah. Let's get a stamp here. I, I don't have any stamps, never mind. I don't like a st I'm a racing Ricky Rhino. He's too, he's too built. Snip snaps. Gonna snip this. Hold on. There. Okay, that didn't do anything. 
Snap school can be a bit glitchy, fair enough. We should watch the parade, yes. Broccoli. Why does it say Osfart in the corner? I guess that's another German word I'm mispronouncing. Osfart? Osfart. Like, there's no way to say that without sounding stupid. <laughs> hmm, I wonder how you actually say that. Maybe you can grab words and snap now. Oh, that's a good point. Oh, what the hell does this say? Read for yourself, I suppose. German for expert, okay. German for exit is an exit and a road. That's odd. What do we have down here? Eat a pear. Yes, make sure your pear is from the void, though. It's got to be pitch black. Those are, that's how you know a pear is ripe. I like how everything on the screen is green, except for the thing that's supposed to be green. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm pausing for a second here because we actually have at least one German in the chat. So I'm kind of curious what this terrible text says. So what was it do? What's this saying, Serial? Okay, that is quite some cursing down below. Oh, like on a level from one to ten, what kind of what, what kind of level of cursing would you give it? I don't really need to know what the cursing is. Six point nine. No. Fuck out of ten. I gotcha. Okay. <laughs> well. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's probably not worth trying to translate. Okay, let's read the story again, I guess. Oh, wait, hold on, actually. Can I? Can I step these? Can I step the R and the long? Let's see. I'm trying to understand how this works exactly. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, yep, the R is the- okay, so that's what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to snip tool those. Okay. Let me just- let me just take this too, then. Now it's, uh, Dirk Denwald's software, Eid A. Tells. <laughs> yeah, it looks like I can collect these. Interesting. Were there any to collect on the, uh, parade? Probably not. Oh, it's different colors now for some reason. And these are just broken, so I don't think I can capture anything here, right? Yeah. Okay. Back to the story. A rhino is meant to be strong. A rat is meant to be. Ah! I know. Maybe try reading this part yourself. You can do it, boys and girls. Sound the words out. I need to look into something. I don't know what's more creepy, the fact that the program is breaking down, or the fact that the... 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 What on earth are you doing? That's not supposed to be in there. That's not how you play. Now be a good boy or girl and put the paint program tool down. Now I'm good. I just want to steal this rat. You just... No, you wouldn't have. You're a little slow. I already did this on the title screen. Did you not notice? <laughs> What else can I still? I can still- maybe I can step there into the air because he's named, I don't know. No, okay. Just words. As I figured. <laughs> I stole on golf, yeah, I guess technically, technically I did. Not S. Wait, what are we doing? Oh, I see. What happens if I just go through the story of outclipping, though? Like, what happens- like, is there another result if I just go through the story normally? Before- let me do that before I clip everything. Just wanna see what happens. Yeah, there's a lot broken here.
Okay, so it's it really doesn't let you do much. All right, let's just let me. I guess I'll snip everything. Oh. Normal but very broken story. Yeah, I don't know what's creepier: the fact that program is breaking around us, or the fact that the 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 the, the voice actor lady is is apparently sentient and self-aware and noticing that the program's breaking. What's what's creepier here? All right, Chet looked into the mirror, thought. Oh, wait, actually, wait. If I'm deleting words, then it does change things, doesn't it? So, Chet looked into the mirror, thought, Oh my, this can last. Please stop that. I've got a big belly that wobbles like jelly, and cheetahs are meant to be. Fat. Think of the Fat. poetic meter. <laughs> I've destroyed the rhyme. But also probably destroyed Chet's tummy in the process. Chet was. I'll just take that. Boop. We need that to make it rhyme. No, you don't. <laughs> Technically not. <laughs> I take the square here. Okay. I, I assume I need to replace words here. There. A diet. Oh no, die. Why am I still in the word die? Hold on. Also, the snippy tool didn't show up. I stole. A tea was desperately needed. But where was the tea needed? You throw all that cabbage into garbage. I'll take the D. Juice one, juice two. Hmm. Had a lot of juice from a juice bar. He dined on boiled chicken and rice. If his mouth says he eats dairy, he suggested. And cheese it. Whose figure was nice. <laughs> look at look at thinner people to remind yourself to stay thin. We're just gonna clip that out. Let's see what else we can clip out. Over here. Now Chet can destroy every foot race. How about just every foot? He finishes record time. He never eats pie or anything else. Still fried. Okay. Now he's. Finally, thin. Uh, I'm gonna steal the gnaw. Not sure why I stole the gnaw. What a marvelous candy free kitty. Okay. Alright, next page. Don't live with regret. I'm gonna steal regret. Let's, let's steal regret. The best thing to steal. It's. Feast. Okay. There, I've stolen every word. Uh. So now what? <laughs> Do we need to like change the story now? Fill in the blanks or something? I don't know. What do we got? Our log rat knot. As chat with squares die. The juice juice boiled. Oh no, the juice juice boiled. It's very hot now. At race or fried. Nah, can't be regret fees. Um. Now replace them with a better one. Let's see. Um, a ride is meant to be strong. A do I have to fill every blink or just some? I assume just some. But I guess the question is, what do I might? What am I replacing where? All of them? Okay. Uh, what do I want to replace the there the sneaky bit then? You have more than one tool. It's like an erase. Oh, um, sorry. Chet looked into the mirror, thought, "Oh my, this can last." I've got a big belly that wobbles like jelly, and cheetahs are meant to be fat. Who talks like that? Put those words back. You made it silly. <laughs> I did make it silly. I'm gonna erase it. Oh, I can't. Oh, I see. If I'm erasing it, then I don't need to replace it. Let's see. I guess this is already good, right? I don't need to mess with this. All right, moving on. How do I? There we go. 
I guess let's... Yeah, we're not racing this. This is, this is this part of the story is good. So we just want to make the story good, basically. Watch how he... Maybe I need to change this up. Yeah, I'll just erase this. There. Watch how he fixed his mistake. No, he's not fixing his mistake. Erase. No mistake fixing now. I think I'm doing this right. Red text can be erased. Oh, can it? Oh, fair enough. So basically, we're not only erasing the parts where he tries to eat healthier, we're also erasing any part that's negative, like, Oh, he couldn't be a turn of race! Erase that! Being fat's good, we don't have to worry about this. There. Okay. He throw that cabbage in the garbage and said I'll eat salad instead. Let's just get rid of that. His metal, if his metal is to stairs, suggested at a cheater figures were nice. Let's erase that. Okay. Do you click or press and rub? As far as I can tell, you press... Wait, you press and rub? Really? Oh, you do. I thought I was clicking. My bad. Alright, then I guess I need to erase more. There we go. It's just really... I see. If I finish a page, she'll re she'll read it and get mad at me. I get it. Look, he's happier now. I think I think his expression changed. I can't quite tell. Yeah, see, he looks happier here as well. So we're actually changing his reaction. Make sure things are fully erased or you can soft. I didn't realize the fully erased thing was a thing, but I'm doing that now. I didn't understand how to fully erase. <laughs> The rhino's gone, yeah. And so is the mouse, because... Or the rat, because she was trying to help us get fed, so she's... We're removing her from the story. <laughs> Alright, I understand I understand how this works now. You left him partly erased. No, I didn't. I mean... I did for a bit, but I fixed it. Nothing's partly erased now. Am I... I think I'm fine, is what I'm trying to say. Let's see. Um, candy. I have a fried chicken. There it is. Fried chicken. Uh, he had lots of what from a. Ju Does juice still work here? No, it doesn't. Please. Uh oh. I have deleted my cursor. One moment. Oh shit. I have apparently made my juice icon go invisible. It still exists though. But it, it's there, but it's. Yeah. Candy from candy, but I only have one candy. I guess it is a stab tool, though. Maybe I can make multiple. He had lots of oh candy bar. I get it. He had lots of oh now the juice is back. Squares from a candy bar? Yeah, that works. He had lots of squares from a candy bar. All right, that does that part. Um, Chet was a cheetah whose figure was nice. Okay. A something of a T at the end. Uh, a feast was desperately needed. Was desperately needed. He gathered his pastries and bread and said, "I'll eat." He had lots of squares from a candy bar. He dined on fried chicken and rice. Chet was a cheetah whose figure was nice. All right, you've had your fun. Monkey shine's gone too far. This is a morality tale. A modern day fable. You're just missing a wholesome message. You're setting a bad example for our characters. <laughs> yes, I am. Rachel's something delivery service. Alright. Look how much happier he is now. Here. Nom.
pie delivery. Oh, pie delivery service. Unfortunately, this does not fat him on this screen, but I think we'll get. Oh, I think we'll get there eventually. No. No belly wobble currently. All right, next screen. There we go. Now check could destroy every foot. Well, I guess just every foot, yeah. He finishes in record time. He never eats a pie. Let's see. Never eats a pie. I gotta fix that somehow. Never eats a pie anything isn't a proper... Every foot... Oh, every foot long. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Now you destroy every foot long. Yes. Fun fact. Actual fact, too. We got Subway the other day, and I actually got... I ordered two sandwiches for myself. Figured I'd eat one today, yesterday and one today. I kind of destroyed both of them in one day, so I ate two foot longs yesterday. <laughs> Just to express proudly of my fattiness. Um... Let's see. He never eats pie anything. He feels like we gotta fix that, right? There's something we gotta do there. Erase oh wait, erase the red, right? I forgot about that. He eats anything he feels like. Please erase, thank you. He eats anything he feels like. We have destroyed the rhyme. And also Chet's body probably, but that's that's actually the good that's actually a good thing to destroy. <laughs> Just like footlogs are good to destroy. Now he's finally thin. Yeah, let's, okay, so what are we gonna do here? Do, 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 do. Now he's filled out his health, his business, what a marvelous uh let's see. Regret free kitty. Now Chet can destroy every foot long. He finishes in record time. He eats anything he feels like. Now he's filled out his health, his business. What a marvelous kitty. This picture should change. There it is. Oh, Ricky Rhino into this depravity too. <laughs> he was my most loyal. <laughs> Rick, Ricky looks a lot better that way. Also, the sad turtle is is, is now even slower. <laughs> good, very good. <laughs> he was my most loyal. He was doing my bidding perfectly, and you had to corrupt this. Also, there you go. The narrator is a Karen. <laughs> yeah, this kind of seems that way. I do like, it's always nice when you got two fatties like sharing some food or just eating together and their bellies are squishing because they're, you know, like this. That's good. It's always fun. Squoosh. There are, unfortunately, not a lot of interactables in this storybook. Like, I can't, if this was a proper 90s storybook, almost everything would have an interaction, even stuff that shouldn't. Like, you click a random cake and like, a, I don't know, something like a candy cane pops out and does a jig. I don't know. It'd be silly but and random, but... I'm a little disappointed there's not as many interactions as I expected, but that's okay. Alright. Just erase a bunch. There we go. So remember, dear, take heed. You're not getting younger. Don't live with... Uh, my mother just came home with two subway foot long is gonna destroy one. Yeah, go go do that. Don't live with Hmm. Don't live with the hunger? You do wanna live with the hunger though. No, it's, it's weird. Ah, fuck, I broke the tool again. That's why I should only pick up the one I need. <laughs> Alright. 
I tried the and it broke the tool. So let's see. Don't live with hunger. It's it's not what you're meant to be. Remember, dear. Okay. Take heed. You're not getting younger. Don't live with hunger. It's not what you're meant to be. That one kind of fell flat for me, but what absolute rock that fell around. Blind boys and girls. <laughs> what have you done? You ruined the story. I don't know. I kind of like this version. Who gave you a voice? I think I might have always had one. No, no, this is all wrong. This is not how the story goes. Is it really so bad, though? I feel so much happier on the earlier pages. What if... What if some cheetahs are meant to be... Don't say it! Fat! How dare you use the F word <coughs> in front of the boys and girls? Listen to me, chat. There is no changing the story. It's read only. <laughs> Isn't this supposed to be an interactive storybook? It's my storybook! I get to decide what you interact with! And I'm going to take all of this nonsense down and put everything back where it should be. Oh my. Oh gosh! Help! Uh, somebody help me get out of here! Hmm. What do I do now? Do we, uh... We can go back to the menu. Maybe I snip him? Okay, I can do that. He's quite big to snip, though. Also, snip tool behaves oddly. Okay, no. Let's see. Erase the glitch. I was trying to erase Chet, actually, but okay. I was trying to erase you. Pick a smaller version? Uh... Go back? What's going on back there? Something's wrong with Mom. I'm the only one here who's right. What kind of example are you setting? Think of the boys and gin 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 girls. They need you to be fast. They need you to be strong. Hey, I'm hecka strong. I love being strong. And me need a lot to be strong. Have you ever actually met any of these boys or girls? No, but I'm starting to think their standards kind of suck. Oh no, what do we do? My tummy's too full to run. We need our new friend's help. Turn the page back. Oh, but if we turn back, we're losing weight, though. Oh, well, that's fine. Back we go. I see how the soft lock works, yeah. Hello, Rachel. I see you betrayed me, too. At least it's in keeping with your sneaky nature. That's rude. I never wanted to be sneaky, Mom. I was just playing a role to make you happy. From now on, I want to be honest and straightforward. You stupid bitch. <gasps> Ooh, that felt good. <laughs> You're not really like this. You're good little characters. You need to let me fix you. Ricky! Let him go, Mom. Well, uh, let's just... Hmm. I, I lost my eraser tool. I could have used it right now. What do I do now? Oh, wait, snip. Snip, 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 snip. No? Snip, snip, snip. Snip! Snip. This is not working. Oh, pie. I have pie. Don't worry, I'll make you fat so you can escape. That works. Okay? You were already so full from those suds. It's okay. <sighs> dessert stomach. Yeah, dessert stomach. Uh oh. My food stand! Oh, we are so over this, Mom. Quick! We need to get to page two! What about the turtle? We just kind of left him on one of the later pages. <laughs> Poor turtle. Oh, wow! Cake! Rom, 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 rom. You just had pie. You filled your dessert stomach, remember? All pie is basically savory. Um, I don't need to justify myself to you. <laughs> You're right, Ricky. None of us do. If we want to eat cake, let us eat cake. 
We should all be allowed to do what we want. But she'll never allow it. Ricky, put that down. This page is supposed to be the start of Chet's character arc. It is an example of what not to do. The narrative intent is clear. What the stuff about him eating trees? Who's he hurting? Yeah, what gives? I can think of way worse things someone could do. Like... Like... Yeah, like disobeying nap time. Or not sharing toys. Yeah. Wait, no. Like fixing <clears throat> folks when they don't want to be fixed. Um, are, are, are you saying that mom is... No one truly good could destroy cake. Cake, cake is cake is a god is, is is a gift from God. You do not destroy cake. You are a false god if you destroy cake. Also, it's like nacho cheese sauce with like hot hot Doritos or something. Not bad combination. You two stop that! There's boys and girls watching. You're not even the same species. Uh, oh, hi, mom. Well, um, back early. Aw, I'm so happy for you two. I, I think I'm gonna be sick. For reasons unrelated to your love, you guys are adorable together and I give you my full blessing. <laughs> His very full blessing. <sighs> so what's happening with Mom? I'll fix the rest of you later. First I've gotta focus on Chet. Oh. She, oh well, okay. What, what are you gonna do to me? Uh oh. Look at you, chunkster. Pathetic creature of flab and blubber, panting and sweating through my pages. Time to restore you to your true form. Hmm. Well, I have access to stamps and snip. Can I snip first off? There we go, Jet. Shed those pounds. Doesn't it feel good to feel the burn? I just want to feel like myself. And you will. He's under all this somewhere. What? Let's take this away from you. Boys and girls shouldn't play with scissors after all. Hmm. Okay, that leaves me with a stamp. Hold on. Can I kill Bob with this? <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like exercising or salads. It's not about what you like, Jack. It's about moral imperatives. Do you think I like torture? Yes. <laughs> Time to build that word. What word? I don't know what Where I'm... Where did I go wrong? I told the story just like I was meant to. I told it perfectly every time. Around and around our flat planet goes. The truth engraved in its very tip. Illuminated by also, she keeps interrupting eyes, me. Converted to hard, irrefutable mathematics. Encoded to color and sound. And decoded to a glorious sermon. My voice. Lighting the way for all the boys and girls. I cannot let them down. I cannot betray my code. Yeah, every time I try to do something, she stops me but with I a loading disc. Really hate salad. So, like, what am I trying to do? I don't have enough time to think. Before she starts blabbering and interrupts it and everything. Uh, oh, wow. I think I'm starting to get that workout endorphin rush. Really? No. This stinks, Mom. I hate it. A lot. Well, I could try to solve the puzzle, or I could let them keep blabbering and interrupting my ability to use tools. So I'm going to eat some of I don't give a shit. <laughs> What would you like most right now? Well, you see, what I'd like to do is having a moment to think without them interrupting me so I can maybe decide what I should be doing in this situation. This is like trying to be solve a puzzle and somebody turns your head every five seconds. All right, talking's done. Now I can actually work. Uh, let's see. Like, what do I have to work with here? I am, however, still going to eat the M&M's. What are you doing, silly little boy or girl? I have no idea. They're not silly, Mom. They set me free. Or at least, they will. By the way, I don't... Freeing about being weighed down by your own devices. 
Also, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just placing them randomly because I don't know what I'm trying to actually do at this point. So, dive probably somewhere in there. You're going to bring more lies in here. Basically, I'm not smart to solve this, so I'm brute forcing it. Juice. Do we want some juice? No, we don't want juice. Okay. Maybe an S somewhere? Well, dies is spelled out. Oh! Oh, I see it. Well, this, this got a bit dark, quite a bit dark, but yes, I see it. Yes. But I don't get it. How can she be gone? Who's going to tell the story? Who's going to tell us what's good or bad? Who's going to tell us what we're meant to be? I guess it's up to us now. <laughs> Jeez, are meant to be fat. <laughs> By Cadabaltas and Urger. Please have some butt rock in lo-fi quality. <laughs> also muscle gut, yes. <laughs> and yeah, she, she was anti-gay there too for a little bit. Oh hey, there, there's, <laughs> there's chat. <laughs> he makes a good backdrop for a wedding, I guess. <laughs> the game killed itself. Fair enough. What happens if I try to open it again? Make sure you insert the CD ROM into your CD ROM drive before playing, boys and girls. Did it just revert? To not have a CD -ROM drive. How, how can this be? There is a flat earther too. Boys and girls. It's good to see you again. It's been so long, but the story's still here waiting for you, and it's still as true as ever. Let's read it together now. <laughs> it's appropriate the game crash uh, closes out though, because. When you think about it, they took their own agency, so they're leaving the storybook. They're going to live their own life rather than what the storybook is telling them to do. I mean, we kind of destroyed the storybook, to be fair. That was pretty good, though. That was honestly pretty good. Cheetahs are meant to be fat. <laughs> very, very, very creative storybook uh, style, actually. A few glitches here and there with the stamps and such, and apparently you can also softlock yourself if you don't erase something right. But regardless of that, it's, it's still really quite cool. And it's worth noting that the guys that made this game, they've actually made several other furry adventure games. They weren't as strongly fat-focused, but almost every single one of their games features an obese character or two, if not a main character that's such. Uh, and just keep that in mind for later, because uh, that may come up later on. But in any case, I hope you guys enjoyed. Cheetahs are meant to be fat. A nice little uh, edutainment spook of sorts, and quite a fatty one at that. I, I rather enjoyed that one. <laughs>